<laughs> all right what's going on guys i wanted to keep my word and post the second half of the story from yesterday uh, just to recap you um you know i left you guys off where we had just gotten to the airport and we were informed that we missed our flight out of dr back to new york okay so before i get into the story in the background i have a free-for-all uh which i win I mean, it was pretty good. I'm running around with the VMP, and it's not really my normal gun of choice. I don't really like the iron sights, uh, but I was working on getting the gold camo, and so I kind of just inserted it into a class that I normally use, and I didn't really think about the iron sights too much. Uh, also, I'm not really a fan of the, the range, and I prefer more accurate guns at range, but whatever. So that's the background. I got a couple of merciless kills. Uh, it was pretty interesting. I had a couple of intense moments that I think you'll enjoy. So back to the story. So here we are. We're at the airport. And um, I got to be honest. The, the people that work, the staff at JetBlue in Puerto Plata, amazing. Some of the, the nicest people I've come across in the uh, consumer industry. You know, pretty much any customer-facing industry. So we basically told them exactly what you know was suggested to us by the people at the resort. And we let them know, hey, a bus broke down, we had some issues, and, you know, can you guys help us out? And they gave us a couple of options. Option A, we could take a three-hour bus ride to the next airport and take a flight. It's going to cost us like 100 bucks each per person, and we fly out the same day. Yeah, my vacation <laughs> was for another week. <laughs> Even though I was going back to New York, I was not planning on leaving and spending extra money just to go home in a rush. So then we were like, all right, what's option B? So option B was spend another night in beautiful Dominican Republic and it doesn't cost us a dime. We leave the next day, pretty much the same time, same flight, all that. <laughs> and so after we pro we made <laughs> we made our boys promise that we were actually gonna make the, the flight on time, uh, which they did, <laughs> we go ahead and decided to to accept option B. Uh, heads up, guys, this is the third time I'm doing this commentary. My allergies are killing me. Oh, man, yeah, I'm dying here. <laughs> but I'm going to do my best to get through the rest. So we uh, the <laughs> that night we went out again, went clubbing again, you know, to the, the same club. But it wasn't the same. It was, I guess, in the middle of the week. It just wasn't as popular. Uh, so we didn't stay out very long, came back to the resort, had a couple of drinks at the bar, and called it a night. And then we ended up leaving the next day, no problem easy come easy go all right so we ended up getting back to new york safe and sound all right guys so there's the end of the story so i'm gonna jump back in time a couple of days tell you about one more part of the trip that i was uh, i was kind of thinking about after the fact so we ended up going on an excursion and we went to this place called paradise island and the name is perfect for where we went beautiful 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 sandbanks oh my goodness man crystal clear water super super clean sand and it was just it was incredible and uh we went scuba diving and i've done that once or twice before in my lifetime but it was it was awesome um on the way there i actually made it met a couple of girls from brooklyn <laughs> so brooklyn stand up <laughs> met a couple of girls from brooklyn and made some friends on the bus on the way there so it was fun you know just just cracking jokes with them and kind of <laughs> and actually being able to speak <laughs> to, to somebody with uh with ease you know if you guys remember how bad my spanish was but yeah <laughs> so it was that was fun um and i'm still I'm still cool with them to to this day <laughs> so um that was awesome, and then on the way back to to the starting point, uh, they took us to this tobacco farm, and they went over the history of cigars and the cigar culture of DR, and they showed us how they wrapped the cigar. It was pretty interesting stuff, man. It was it was enjoyable. Uh, so then, you know, we did all that, came back to the resort, and you know, it was a good part of the trip. So my suggestion for you guys is, if you get the opportunity to go on vacation, whether it's with fr family or with friends. Do what you can to meet as many people, say hi to as many people as possible. You know, just make friends. You never know when somebody might make an impact in your life. And, and even if it's nothing more than just a passing friendship, it's still nice to, to have a smiling face uh, greet you when you're on vacation. So it's awesome. So I, I definitely recommend that for you guys. And I try to do that every time I go away. It just adds to the experience. As you see, I get my hater. Um, 
Oh man, this match was pretty good. I'm gonna I'm gonna jump back into the match. This match was pretty good, man. There was this one guy. <laughs> he was pretty good, but he was annoying the hell out of me. This guy wavy. Yeah, <laughs> in his hero his hero costume and his dark matter camo, man. He's driving me crazy. <laughs> Look at this crap, man. You know, I was getting I was starting to rage. <laughs> Every time I got on a kill streak, he would kill me and then I would die instantly as soon as I spawned back in. It's driving me nuts, man, but you know, I ended up winning, so I was happy about that. <laughs> so you, you know I definitely was proud of that. Um but <laughs> I definitely could have used this hater better to my advantage. Oh, man. All right. So the game is wrapped up. The story is wrapped up. Uh, thanks for listening, guys. I do appreciate it. Thanks for the activity in the last com commentary that I posted. You know, I love having a conversation with you guys. Uh, and I hope you enjoyed this video. It was just a quick follow-up video to yesterday's. And I hope to bring you some more content in the next couple of days. All right, guys. It's your boy, Air of Gotham. Signing off.